What's up guys, if you're new here, my name is Arden Chibley and I'm a professional drone pilot here at Yellow House Aerial. We provide aerial cinematography for film and television and try to share what we learned in these videos. Today we're talking about gear but we're going a little smaller with gift ideas for the drone pilot in your life. Let's get started. We'll start with some inexpensive gifts and work our way up. First up is an AKS bag, which in film land stands for all kinds of shit. You can have an AKS bag, an AKS crate, an AKS box, or an AKS shelf, and they're useful for just all kinds of shit you wouldn't find anywhere else. You can get AKS bags with Velcro or drawstring closures, either works fine. In our AKS bag, we have tools, SD cards, spare parts, and some of the items in this video. Having all of these assorted pieces of gear in one place is super valuable. Next up, gear whips, which you may have seen in Peter McKinnon's videos, available from Think Tank on Amazon, but these ones are more appropriately priced. I use these to strap cables together, hold earphones and their cables in one place, a nice neat little package, and I keep a few strapped to my bags, so they're there when I inevitably need them. I've ordered like 40 of these, and I've run out just because they're so useful. Number three, Velcro. Simple but so useful. Cut it to length, stick your card reader to your desk, Velcro a tool or accessory to anywhere you might need it. You don't realize how useful it is until you start using it. Number four, a little air blower. I had a nice one, I think it rolled into the ocean a couple years ago, whoops. I've had this basic one ever since and it works great. You can clean dust or snow off items without breathing on them, you can get into tight spaces or work on electronics without damaging them. It's a really basic but useful tool to have in your kit. Number five, microfiber cloths. If you can find them, I use Scotch-Brite cloths because they have more texture that will absorb oils instead of pushing them around. They leave your filter, sunglasses, or phone screen nice and clean. People even use the ones I have in my car and backpack all the time because they know they're there and they've seen how well they work compared to their shirt. Number six, an assortment of writing utensils. Usually a few gigantic black sharpies like these, some white paint markers, and a few water-soluble markers will provide a pen for every need. Getting a little more expensive now to seven and eight. Together, they're like microfiber cloths to the extreme. We have Pancro Lens Cleaning Solution and Kimtech Wipes. These babies will leave anything cleaner than you ever thought possible, and they represent the standard for lens and screen cleaning in the film world. Pancro, sounds weird, works amazing. Number nine, this one is pretty standard for anybody that does video, but makes a great gift if your drone pilot doesn't already have them. Just ask them, hey, do you use filters? If not, pick them up a set of ND filters for their video work. They will definitely thank you. They're basically like sunglasses for your drone. Just Google ND filters and then the name of their drone, and you'll find what you need. Number 10, a landing pad. You can get cheap ones, but I tend to prefer nice things you only have to buy once. A company called Hoodman makes heavy duty weighted pads that will last forever. Check out the links in the description for different sizes. If you're curious why a nice landing pad is worth it, see this video comparing a Hoodman pad to a cheaper one. Number 11, and this one is my favorite. These last three are a little higher on the budget mark, but depending, they might be worth splurging a little. So sometimes they end up working with gear in the dark, or hey, if they like drones, they'll probably just appreciate this one for what it is. This is my tactical flashlight. Why tactical? Because they're tough, reliable, water resistant, and last a long time on a single pair of batteries. I use the Surefire Fury. There are a few different lights made by Surefire. I'd recommend one that uses multiple batteries. Mine is a 100-500 lumen combo, and it's crazy bright for its size. I love it. 10 out of 10 would recommend. Second last, number 12, is a solid pair of sunglasses. If your drone pilot is not prone to losing them, a good pair of sunglasses can be worth far more than their weight in fashion sense. Protecting your eyes from UV rays and excessive light exposure not only while working, but on a daily basis is super important for the longevity of your eyeballs, and everyone, especially those working in the visual arts, should take care of their eyes. If you're finding some good ideas here, or maybe you just don't like my hair or something, you know what to do. If you want to support what we do here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button to see what else we're into. Okay, this last one is definitely a little bit expensive, but depending on your budget and maybe your drone pilot has everything else, hard cases like these ones from Nook make great places to store media, batteries, lenses, and even your entire drone. You can get little sizes like this that might fit SD cards or small electronics, even serving the purpose of making something small larger so you won't damage or fumble it. That way I can hand my media card to a crew member while working on a windy mountain and there's much less risk of dropping it in the snow, which is both annoying and can damage the electronics. If you opt for larger cases like this one, they become the primary method of organization, storage, and transportation of expensive gear and ensure everything arrives dry and in one piece. And hey, you can add some flair with a color that matches their style or brand and then deck them out with cool stickers that you pick up along your travels. That's the list. I'd love to hear what you decide and whether or not it's a success. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Arden for Yellow House. Don't forget to hit subscribe and I will see you in the next video.